Hey everybody, I'm back y'all with another video. So let's jump into it. Let's see what's going on with the masculine and the karmic. And we're going to pull some cards from, let's see. We're going to pull some cards from the twin flame journey, okay? So let's see what's going on. Let's see what's on the masculine's mind when it comes to dealing with the karmic. For everybody who has supported my channel, thank you all. For everybody who has booked a personal reading with me, as well as shopped on my website, www.empressempireoils.com. Thank y'all so much. All right, so let's jump into it, guys. Let's see what's going on. How does this masculine feel about the karmic? I feel like this masculine could be trying to reinvent himself um, into something, um, trying to be like an inspiration or be like inspiring. Um, so he could be switching up his communication. He feels like he does have free will to, you know, reinvent himself. So that's what I feel like he is trying to do. Okay. I feel like maybe he has communicated this with the karmic as well. I feel like this masculine could also feel like this karmic has put up a barrier or put up some type of block for him taking some type of new direction, okay? So the karmic is blocking him from doing anything new. That's what he's feeling like as well. He feels like this connection with his soulmate has been destroyed because of dealing with the karmic. So he's not going to be able to get a fresh start with his divine feminine right now because the karmic he feels blocked okay he feels blocked yeah divine masculine and big dreams okay so definitely this masculine has some type of goal in mind that he wants to accomplish but he feels like the karmic is definitely in the way of him accomplishing some type of goal we got third party right here so he does feel like this third party has blocked him from reaching some type of goal. I feel like either he has already communicated that with the karmic or he plans on communicating that with the karmic, okay? So tell me more about how this masculine feels about the karmic. We got photographs and seduction. So there has possibly been some pictures floating around with this masculine and the karmic. But this, this masculine is very self-indulgent and more focused on himself, okay? And I feel like he has uh, broken many hearts, stabbed a bunch of people in the back, okay? Dealing with this karmic. Dealing with this karmic, he has been stabbing people in the back, left and right, okay? He definitely feels like he stabbed Divine Feminine in the back to deal with the karmic. The karmic is blocking him from reaching his goals. Is a big. I feel like the karmic is a big distraction. Thank you, spirit. How else does this masculine feel? Oh yeah, we got the moon and the magician. So this masculine could feel like this karmic did some type of spell work on him okay yeah this masculine feels like this karmic has done some type of spell work on him yep for him to leave his marriage or to leave his relationship with dealing with divine feminine here Okay, and I feel like this masculine is having some type of regrets. He's having some type of regrets that the connection that he was in has ended because of him dealing with the karmic.
Wow. Wow, guys. What else? How does this masculine feel about this karmic? I feel like this masculine has been spying on you. Okay. I'm here. What you want me to say? What do you want me to say? What you want me to do? Tell me more about this spying energy. Why is he spying? For some of you, this masculine, you and this masculine either were together for a long time or this masculine made some type of promise that he did not keep. He didn't keep this uh, promise. And I feel like this is something that he thinks about every day. He thinks about this every day. He did not keep his word. He didn't keep his word. Okay, Five of Pentacles and the Hierophant. What else? The High Priestess. The ma I feel like this masculine intuition is telling him that he needs to try to find some type of balance. But I feel like he's not listening to his intuition. He's continuing to move forward. Okay. Yeah, he's very wild. This masculine is very toxic, very wild, very narcissistic, very irrational. He like he makes irrational decisions. I feel like this masculine wanted to have his cake and eat it too, definitely. And I feel like this masculine also could be dealing with financial issues as well. So he wants to keep this karmic around um, because he could be going through something financially. It feels like if he leaves this connection, if he walks away from this connection, I really do feel like this masculine thinks spell work is involved. I really do think this masculine feel like it's so spell work involved. I really do. This masculine feels like this karmic has done some spell work, um, has had some work done on him to leave a connection and be with her. All right, so that's what I got, guys. Y'all let me know what's going on in the comment section below, and I'm going to chat with y'all later. Ciao.